got a little mic. Dang it, I fell off. But I got a little mic. I hope it works. Um, because apparently my voice is very quiet. And I edit it. And I put it up to like 400%. But still, the video comes out so quiet. I don't understand. In my head, I'm talking as loud as everybody else. Anyways. It's Monday. It feels like a Monday already, and it's only 6.57 a.m. I'm gonna get some collagen. It's so pretty. Pretty pink. It tastes pretty good too, honestly. It's pomegranate citrus. Just pretty good. Is this? Hopefully this thing is working. I'm gonna drink this and meditate, and then I'm gonna hit the gym. Also, I'll link this below. Um, I don't know if it works quite yet because I've only had it like three times. Um. But I'm sure it does. But yeah, it tastes pretty dang good. So I'll drink it either way. <laughs> oh my gosh. Couldn't speak. Clearly, I need to use. Clearly, I need to learn how to use one of these things. Because it was rustling and bustling around all over my shirt. So sorry about the first clip, but it'll get better. I promise. chirping. It's my favorite town ever. That's why I want to live in the nature instead of a big city, but in a few years it'll happen. Let's see if I'm cool enough to get this transition to work. <laughs> that probably didn't work at all. For breakfast, I'm gonna make a smoothie bowl, which I'm very excited for because I really haven't had one in a long time, but it's been in the 60s here. So, warm weather just makes me want a smoothie. But I'm going to use this protein powder, Pure Food Protein Powder. It is my favorite protein powder ever um, because the ingredients are literally amazing. They're so clean and they have probiotics in them. And with each sale they make, they donate meals to hungry families. And the owner genuinely cares about your health. 
which is a characteristic that you don't find in a lot of brands. A lot of health, health food brands say that they want to help your health and they say they're health food brands, but then you look at their ingredients and you look at where they source it from and it's really just not as good. So I love this protein powder. I'm gonna link it down below. Um, you can get 20% off for it. You don't have to use a code. The code automatically applies. Um, but yeah, it's my favorite and it tastes good. What more could you ask? Okay, so I just put a banana in. Now I'm gonna put cherries and berries and cauliflower. Cauliflower, cauliflower is my favorite thing to put in smoothies because you're adding more veggies into your diet, which is already a thing that a lot of us struggle with, but you also can't taste it at all. I used to put broccoli in my smoothies too. You can definitely kind of taste those and you'll get like little green bits <laughs> in the smoothie. Um, but I convinced myself for the longest time that it tasted good. I no longer do it, but also zucchini works. Zucchini works really well. Apparently also cucumber works amazing, but I've never tried it. Um, yeah. Oat milk. Oat milk's my favorite. Just a little bit, because we want it thick. We're making a thicky, okay? Not a thinny. And last but not least, USANA's Fiber G Active Powder. I don't have glasses or contacts in, so I can't really read the ingredients. Um, but it is very good. Literally, it says to put one tablespoon, but when I put a teaspoon, it fills me up. It makes me go to the bathroom. So, I like it a lot. I'll also link this down below. So I'm going to put cinnamon toast cereal in it, chocolate cereal in it, granola in it, and hemp seeds. Bon appetit. My hair looks so bad. Thumbnail. Watch me not use it. Ten out of ten. Too good. Whoops. I totally missed that. There's cops walking around our parking lot right now. I just want to know who did it. I'd be lying if I said this wasn't first. Okay, so I gotta send an email now. Send out an email. Where's my password? Okay. To my, I gotta send out an email to my email list. Um, first email going out. I used to send some emails every so often, but then I definitely fell off of it because I didn't know what to talk about. Um, but lately I've been really taking my businesses seriously. Really trying to grow, get myself out there, get my name out there. So we're gonna do better. And we're going to send one email a week. I think that's reasonable. Is this thing on? I hope so. Anyways, this is like my little talking mic. It's kind of fun. I could do a little concert for you guys. I'm not going to though. I'm going to save you that embarrassment. Okay, so also, if you want to be added to my email list, the link is in the description. Um, I send out emails 
about health coaching, how to sign up for my health coaching. Um, I give you updates on my businesses, especially my snack food business, which is currently in the works. Um, if you shop from me, you'll get an email from that. Yeah, just little updates, little tidbits, little information about health, health tips, health products, my products. Because I want to make the world better and healthier and happier. That's genuine. I'm not just saying that. I typed up this email last night. Because it just came to me to do it. I'm hoping this type form link works, So, How do I do this? I swear, I wish I had, like, an assistant, partner, you know, someone I could pay to help me do all these marketing things, because I don't know what I'm doing. I didn't go to marketing school, um, but I don't have the money for that right now. Later, though. Gotta outsource later. All subscribed contacts. Six recipients. Not a lot, but you know, it's a start. Subject. Exciting news. Exclamation point, exclamation point. Another exclamation point. Is that too many? No. It's pretty exciting news. You would know if you're on it. Just saying. Preview text. Do I need that? I wouldn't even know what I would put. Also, the cops did leave. They didn't knock on our door. But they knocked on about everybody's door, so... I don't know who they were looking for, but disappointing. I'm really disappointed in these people I live with, live by. Do better. The cops seem nice, though. I don't know. They seem nice. They knocked on my neighbor's door, and I could hear pretty much everything they were saying. My heart did start racing though, because I thought they knocked on our door. I swear. Even if I know that I am completely innocent, when I see a cop, my heart still starts racing. Okay, I love cops. They do great, okay? I'm not one of those people that hates cops. Because how, how do you hate cops? How can you cancel cops? You can't, okay? Because if we did that, this world would be a shit show. Some people are crazy. Not every cop is bad. There are some interesting ones okay those people i'd say okay maybe we should fire them okay they're not doing their job the best but we need them okay stop saying cancel the cops do you know what you're getting yourself into if we do that some big doo-doo okay it's not good what was i doing what was i saying i don't even know Preview text. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> it says, that's impressive. You got your point across without using too many punctuation marks. I didn't put anything in the box. <laughs> oh god, I feel slap happy and it's only 10.20 a.m. That's not good. Exciting news. What should the preview text be? I can't say it, because if you know it, then why would you sign up? If you sign up, you will get this email. Just saying, better subscribe. Haven't made you feel guilty yet for not subscribing? I hope so. <laughs> you need to be on this email list. You're missing out, if not. I send great fun emails. 
This may be my first one. Okay. But by the time you sign up, I will probably have sent two or three. So. This clip is so long. I need to stop talking. Goodness, I'm not business professional. Mm, that's a good one. Eight words. I said use nine or fewer. Maybe I am good at this. It's out there. Exciting news is on its way to six subscribers from the audience Alexis Fawn. Take a breather, you've earned it. <sighs> I need to do schoolwork. I didn't do schoolwork at all last week. I promise I'm a good student. We just don't have schoolwork this week, so really I'm not behind. I have a whole other week. Oh <laughs> my voice. Now that sending an email is done, I kind of need to post on Instagram. Alright, I'm probably, my hair is probably making so many noises on this thing. I'm trying to keep it out of the way, but it's difficult. My hair goes everywhere. Okay. I kind of need to post on Instagram. I don't know what to post, though. Should I make a reel? I'll make a reel. Okay. I'm gonna go do that. I would show you me making it, but I don't have a camera. I'm using my phone to record this, and I need to use my phone to record a reel, so. One day, one day, I told myself that when I get to the point of making money from YouTube, I will buy a camera, and I will purchase a good editing app but for right now I don't have the room to spend money on a camera and spend money on an editing app so I'm waiting until I'm at least making a profit back while I'm putting money out so one day my videos will be high quality and edited great but for right now hang in there <laughs> Stay long for the low quality ride. Hello again. I posted a reel. You should go check it out. At Alexis Fawn underscore. It's my Instagram. Right now, I'm going to chill for a little bit. 15, 20 minutes. Watch a YouTube video. I just watched YouTube for probably 30 minutes. And now it's lunchtime, and I'm feeling a yogurt bowl. Watch me make my food. Okay. Oh, you can literally just see my computer. I don't know why, like, literally, yogurt is, like, my favorite thing right now. And I used to, like... <laughs> I'm, like, bending down so much. I'm straddling. <laughs> I used to eat non-dairy yogurt only, but honestly, this yogurt is just so good. It's like, it made me realize, like, honestly, non-dairy yogurt just really does not compete, okay? really does not. And I don't eat a lot of dairy either. I really honestly try to stay away from it because it causes me acne and my digestion just don't like it but this stuff it is greek yogurt but it doesn't mess with my digestion at all like whatsoever and i love that i got this massive bag of apples and i haven't touched them yet but we're gonna have one they're so tiny <laughs> but compared to my hand I have tiny hands. It's so cute. Okay, so you can probably hear me right now. Um, I'm pretty sure you can hear me right now at least. 
I'm currently going to wash my apple with 11.5 strong alkaline water because it's an oil emulsifier. So I'll get all of the pesticides off of my apple. Because we don't want to eat those. Pesticides literally are just slowly killing us. Even organic fruit has pesticides on them. But literally, ever since I started taking the pesticides off of my fruit and produce, they just taste so much better. Like, it tastes so much better. I'm going to put some cinnamon on it. Because why not? Surprise. No one's surprised about this. Genuinely, if you have not tried this brand cereal, go do it. It literally pretty clean and it's really good. I'm not keto by any means. I love my carbs. But it is very good. And it's low sugar, so it's not going to leave you with that blood sugar spike. It's delicious. I thought about kind of making like a recipe in this video. But I don't know what I would make. Let me know in the comments what kind of things you guys want to see. Because I'm getting bored of my life and I'm only like three videos in. Um, I don't think that's good. I just want to make sure like y'all aren't getting bored. And like I'm giving you what you want to see. Like health tips you want to hear about. Literally anything. Also I want to start answering questions at the end of my videos. Like two or three questions from you guys be about health, nutrition, fitness, primary foods, it can be about life, it can be literally whatever. Clothes, fashion, I'm not a fashionista, but I do love my active wear. I literally live in it. Um, but yeah, I'm going to start asking questions because I made this YouTube video so then I can connect with you guys because Instagram just was not doing it for me. Because, I mean, being a business owner, you want to connect with the people that are buying from you, you know? Like, you're so grateful for them. I'm very grateful for every single person who has bought from me before and who continues to buy from me. And I just haven't been able to find a way to really connect and feel like we have a community going here. Because I really want to create a community, a little like Alexis Fawn community. It'd be really fun for me. So I want to connect with you guys, talk to you guys, instead of me just talking to the camera. And hoping you guys are listening on the other side. So I just want to connect in that sense. So if you have any questions for that segment, leave them in the comments, please. I'm going to go eat my lunch now. My hair is insane. Alrighty, since it's so nice outside, literally 60 degrees, Miss Penny and I are going to go on a walk. We're going to go on a walk. We can go on a walk. Show me how excited you are. You wanna go on a walk? Penny. Yeah. Oh, you're such a good girl. Me. Yeah. Can you go get your leash? <laughs> okay. We're here. My heart is literally pounding so hard because I'm just so excited that it somewhat feels like summer. Obviously, that's a bit pushing it because it's like 60 degrees. But summer is just so happy. It gives such good vibes. I feel like everybody's just so much happier in the summer. Summer is just so much better. The sun, the nature, the being outside all the time just feels so good. So I'm just so happy. <laughs>
you know the scooters that like the electric ones on college campuses i'm not sure if you can hear but there's monkeys the zoo is on the other side of this wall so i asked kobe if he wanted to come with me on this walk and as expected he said no <laughs> he just wants to hang out today which was kind of sad because i wanted him to come but he promised me Chipotle for dinner, so a fair trade to me. Stay in school poster boy. Quit. You wanna go outside? <laughs> Hi from my couch. You probably can't really see me that well, but whatever. This is gonna end the video though. Thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate it. It was a very chill day, but still a very productive day. I honestly, unpopular opinion, I like to take Mondays easy because everybody in the world is taking Mondays so hard everybody's very productive everybody's doing everything so like if you're that one person just hanging out acting like it's a sunday with like a little bit of work it's gonna act like you have the world all to yourself and it's honestly pretty nice but thank you for tuning in i'll see you in the next one